It was very common in the 70s, 80s and 90s and early 2000s for a family to use blank VHS tapes and record their favourite TV shows. Most of the time, tapes have been recorded over numerous times. And now it's up to me to find the last mystery VHS tape and see what shit we can salvage. This is Mystery Tape Time. What is up YouTube? We are back for another mystery videotape. These are probably my favourite thing to do. Uh, I've got the big box. Big massive box that I brought from uh, just the local local marketplace. Paid 50 bucks and got like 100 tapes and they're all mystery tapes. So we're pulling them out one by one. We got enough to do two years worth. So this one I pulled out is called Mystic Pizza. It's the Mystic Pizza. Now of course I've already had a watch of this. We've put it onto the uh, computer transferred from the VHS player. And I'm gonna show you all the best bits. Not the movie, we're gonna show you the commercials, all the best bits. If there was any best bits on this, this is the seventh episode. This is Mystic Pizza. This is Mystery Tape. Let's do this! Ah. Be mad about you. Oh. All right. So my favorite thing is when you put the VHS in the player, and the first thing that comes up. And so far in all the episodes, everything that's written on it has come up, but this time Flying Doctors. Is it Flying Doctors? I think that's Flying Doctors. Flying Doctors, an Australian drama. Australian drama show came up, and that's the first thing that was on this tape. But we are gonna fast forward and see what else is on this because we don't watch that rubbish. And these are all the tapes that are done so far. Mask, Color Purple, Midnight Express, Ren and Stimpy, Underwater World, Into Domain 1989. So Mystic Pizza was up next. We're gonna fast forward that crap because it's taped off TV, so we're gonna get all the TV ads. So now I'm gonna show you all the best shit that's on this tape. And hopefully there was enough stuff to put on an episode because sometimes these tapes have nothing on them. Slam it down fast. Probably one of the greatest ads when I was a kid. I always wanted to go kayaking when you saw that ad of the Solo Man. We always called him the Solo Man. Brilliant ad, brilliant product, and that's when the uh, advertising the the big mouth, so you can slam it down faster. Weekly is cover to cover excitement. Demi Moore compares husband Bruce Willis with reluctant lover Patrick Swayze. These magazines are a little bit juicy, aren't they? Comparing husbands with. Uh, this is... what do you guys read? Susan Renouf announces her latest scheme. We reveal Mike Willis's newest hurdle. Expose inside secrets from the Aussie who works for the Royals. And Premier... Absolutely love a good inside secret, especially when it comes to the Royals. So this is a magazine that we should look out for. And Premier brings you up to the minute Hollywood gossip. Help your husband through his midlife crisis. Our... What midlife crisis? What midlife crisis? Are our schools up to standard? Make these clever Christmas gifts. Stunning summer salads. Give yourself a facelift. Look years younger in six weeks. Give yourself a facelift. Fuck. People buy this? Be in to win $10,000 just by reading the November Weekly. Did anyone win that $10,000? Write down in the uh, comments down below. If, if you read this magazine and you knew someone or you won that $10,000, they never say who wins it. They never say who wins it. I don't believe it. I just don't believe it. If you're looking for something special, here it is. The ultimate pan pizza. Pizza Hut Grand Pan Pizza. Not eight, not nine, but ten delicious toppings. And right now, you can have garlic bread, a jug of Pepsi, and medium Grand Pan for just $16.90. Grand Pan Pizza. Ten toppings deep all over. Just waiting for you at... Pizza Hut. Dine-in, takeaway, or home delivery. 
that was a pretty good deal. I miss Pizza Hut All You Can Eat. I don't know if anyone else uh, watching this went to Pizza Hut All You Can Eat back in the day, but I used to absolutely love it. Absolutely love taking a container and taking as much shit home as you could. Fuck the 90s, rocked, 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 absolutely rocked. And you can gather this is going to be a 90s video straight. It's amazing what you'll find at Perth Airport. Perth Airport Duty Free brings you a major leap forward in camera technology. The new Pentax Zoom 105 Super. Motorized zoom from wide angle all the way to 105 mil telephoto. Liquid crystal display panel. Flash, motor drive, auto focus, auto everything. Just $449 duty free. The Pentax Zoom 105 Super at Perth Airport duty free. A great place to shop. Seven days a week. 450 bucks for that. That must have been a wicked camera back in the 90s because that looks so shit now. And that was duty free, that was cheaper price as well. So that's just crazy. Was that a good camera? Do you know if that was a good camera? International style. The Pierre Carin suit collection at just $299. An unrepeatable $200 off. From New York, the Wall Street. Did you see the mobile phone he was just using? That mobile phone was a brick. Kids will watch this and go, what the fuck was he just using? Yes, that was a mobile phone. That was huge. Yo, do you know what's hot? Hot wings, yeah. I can't, I can't, I can't wait. Kentucky Fried Chicken, hot wings. I can't wait. Spicy, yo, crispy flavor, hey yo. I can't wait. A new spicy, crispy flavor. You can't wait. I think that could actually possibly be the greatest KFC ad that was ever made. Ever made, ever. I actually don't remember ever seeing that ever. Or remember those hot wings. So I want those hot wings. That is our number one commercial so far on all these videos. Is that is wicked. <laughs> Strongbow Drive, please. Strongbow Alcoholic Cider. Sweet, dry or draft. Get into it any way you can. It should have actually been made to cover the cost of smashing those uh, glasses and bottles for whistling so loud. Uh, there was no need for it. Um, wait your turn in line like everyone else. Bit rude. Whistling. They're just doing their job. Come on. No need for it. No fucking need for it. Friend pre-wash stain remover. 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 That's got to be number one, the worst ad ever. Friend stain remover. But then also, it's just got to be the worst name to call your product. Friend. That obviously didn't last because I've never seen that in the shops in my life. I've never seen that until I've seen it on this video. Friend. 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 The limited edition 1.8 litre Nissan Pulsar Reebok. With two and a half grand worth of extra value at no extra cost, you'd better run for it. Or you'll miss out. It's a Nissan. That's my car. Wouldn't it be like... Copyright claims from Reebok shoes, or is Reebok actually a part of this production with the car? Reebok shoes with the Nissan car. Let me know in the comments. Is that true? Was that the actual Reebok with Nissan? But that means if Reebok is with the car, that means the car would run faster because it's got now Reebok shoes as well. I don't fucking know. Sunday on 60 Minutes. The one race, millions stop to watch. The crowd's just amazing. The one race a year where you all stop to lose a shit ton of money. Inside story of Australia's top jockeys. Who came first, the horses or you? I'll leave that one to him. <laughs> oh, he can't ask her that. Who came first, the you or the jockey? You can't ask that, that reported, and then they use it as an ad, they can't ask that. Who came first? Who came first? And she even laughed and went, ho, <laughs> There's lots and lots of yummy ways to get some sunshine in your day. Crispy crackers, savory snacks, sunshine strip is where it's at. Sunshine strip. Sunshine strip. Just take a trip down to sunshine strip. You 
you'll go crackers over Sunshine's new savoury snacks and crackers. There's stacks of snacks in every pack. Sunshine's trip. Sunshine's trip. Just take a trip down to Sunshine. Yeah, that was a creepy ad. And there's another product that never really took off because I don't know anything on the shelves here in my shops that are called Sunset Strip. I'm not, I'm not getting into that one. You tell me if you like that ad or not. That ad was shit. Shit. in long necks. Look out. That was a good ad. I love those 90s Australian beer ads. Always makes you want to fucking crack open a frothy. Bloody good ad. Makes you want to have a beer. I like it. I like it. One of the top ads. One of the top ads. We've got two top ads. Two top ads for a pretty shit video so far. Come to the beer server and step up with your step leather for only $16.95. Luigi! Stands $27.95. Money boxes a dollar each. Handy bow saws from $4.95. Household broom head only $4.95. Sink plungers from $1.50. Audio cabinets holds $36. $9.95. Soft toilet seat $24.95. WD spray and degreaser glass and upholstery cleaner all $2 each. And here's the toolbox. Three fries for eleven ninety five. So come out to the beer service. We're open Thursday night. We loved Luigi when we were kids. WA Salvage ads, best. <laughs> and we did used to go Thursday nights as well. We did go Thursday nights. This place was open when I was a little kid. They had the best cheap imitation toys there. Kind of like your reject shop now. But this was so much better. This was like your size of Bunnings. Huge. This was cool. Cool place. Love WA Salvage. Luigi, save it a money. Save it a money. Western Wisdom plus Western Science. The secret of my 7-day work control program. Slimex APS Capsule. Each capsule contains a pure herbal extract and vital proteins and vitamins. Used with a calorie control diet for natural work control. Without drugs, without side effects. This must have been a paid for TV ad because I... It, that, that's random. These paid for late night TV ads are great. It's got no side effects and it's got no symptoms. You'll get no symptoms. Slimax APS capsules from chemists and health food stores. And I'm guessing it's another product that never took off because I've never seen that on the shelves either. So, 90s, what happened to your products? The messages that some of these ads give, if you really pay attention, she's about to get married and because she drank Southern Comfort, her ex bikey boyfriend just drives motorbikes it straight into the wedding and steals her away and she's like, fuck this little prick that I'm fucking marrying, he's a little pencil neck geek, I don't want to stay with him, fucks off with her ex bikey boyfriend, they're gonna go drink fucking Southern Comfort. Take a shot of mm, take a shot, take a shot of comfort, take a shot of Southern Comfort. Take a shot of Southern Comfort. Southern Comfort, you'll leave your partner. So next up on the tape, um, after Mystic Pizza was finished, we had uh, Late Night with Steve Vizard. Uh, Steve Vizard, in my opinion, wasn't that very funny, but he had his own late night show. Now you got to see this guy that he got from the uh, crowd. This guy. Greggy from St Kilda. Come on up, Greg. Come on up, Greg. Are you Greggy from St Kilda? Are you Greggy from St Kilda? When I watched this, it was a really boring show and it was pretty crap, but I didn't fast forward through it, but he gets this random guy from the uh, audience to come up and join him. And he's got hardly any teeth. Of course, he's got hardly any teeth. And he explains why he's got hardly any teeth. Are you, uh... So, uh, why, you're obviously a Collingwood supporter. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry, so <laughs> I heard you back for a second. Is that true? They're not stereotypes. This is from the 90s, and it just proves that these Collingwood fans 
a part of all the jokes that everyone tells and all that, it is true. It is true. So Collingwood fan, no teeth, all makes sense. All makes sense. So from this ad here, it's established that uh, from this Wildcats ad, the, 19, the 1990 grand final right there, and this is the 1990 tape. From 1990, we haven't had a 1990 tape yet. Here it is, it's my ray, Luigi's super ray, for only 395. <laughs> Isn't he great? Isn't Luigi the best? <laughs> is Luigi super ray? Salad or plain chalk, 95 cents each. Basketball hoop set, 4 95 Light for joggers by Dunlop, $16.95. Foam wine coolers, $4.50. Trim deck fiberglass roof sheeting from $13.95. 3.6 metre wide knitted shade cloth, $6 per metre. Plastic chest of drawers from $29.95. This 5 litre Angus fryer is only $7.95. At WA Salvage, we're open Thursday night. Can someone please buy the franchise of WA Salvage and reopen it, please? I'm begging, I am begging. Cures for baldness. The facts are, there is no cure for baldness, and that over 40% of men start to lose their hair by the age of 26. But many of these men have improved their appearance by consulting Advanced Hair Studio. Because for more than a decade, Advanced Hair Studio has consistently introduced hair replacement techniques that really work. Hair fusion and strand by strand are both proven hair replacement techniques invented by Advanced Hair Studio that require no surgery, yet provide a totally natural looking full head of hair. And proven by the fact that more than 100,000 people, including Australian and international athletes, actors and businessmen, have improved their appearance by consulting Advanced Hair Studio. For a hair replacement procedure that really does work. <laughs> I love how these bald pricks suddenly, uh, when they get hair, they can, they can get the bird now, they can get the girl now. Look at this, look at this shot. Look at this shot of during that ad. It's saying, you're gonna get hair, you're gonna get laid. You've got hair, you're getting laid. Fucking hate those advanced hair ads. Hate them, they've always been around. All right guys, that is the end of the tape. Wasn't a long tape of good stuff. Not much good stuff on here, but this was 1990. Mystic Pizza was 1990. So, we'll add 1990 to the list there with all the other ones that we've had. So out of all the tapes, this is the seventh tape. And there we go, there's your chart of the years that we've had. All right guys, cheers for watching again. Wasn't the greatest episode, but we're gonna get a tape that is an absolute gold mine. So next episode, we'll see what we grab out of the box. Make sure you like, subscribe. There's other stuff on this channel as well. Don't forget the horror movie stuff. Don't forget the kiss reviews. Don't forget the thrifting. There's a little bit of everything for everyone. That's what I'm trying to do for this channel is just expand it and just have fun all the way through. So make sure you subscribe and it's free. It's free to click that little button. So, and everyone loves a good freebie. All right, guys, thanks heaps, and I'll see you if you join me on uh, Horrors, or if you join me on uh, Kiss, or if you join me again next week just uh, for this one again. See you!